hello how are you doing it's a new year and happy new year to you in your business and what you need to do i'm ibram Marupe by name a certified john c Maxwell business coach and a consultant here in my home country nigeria all over the world is a new year and i believe we all have a new year resolution you write big list what you want to do your to-do list and what you should not do but have you ever wondered why these things don't work by January 12 or 15th or 13th or even before month end, most of us have forgotten all these resolutions. Why? Because there is no clear definition of purpose. Now work with me in these few minutes, I will guide you through what is suggested things I believe will work for you in this new year. The number one thing, go get your pen and diary right now and write this thing down. The number one thing should be a clear definition of purpose that is what you need in this year. You can't do everything or you can't do anything pick that one thing and go for it and how should you do this that is where you need to use the smart formula to go over this which is number one which has to do with you need to be specific in your goal what is that thing do you truly want this year be specific niche it out and write it and go for that thing you can't be everywhere in this year last year you were you did a lot of things you got nothing so this year adjust it a bit and pick one thing and go for that thing which is a, I'll take it again. Let's take A, specific. You need to be secure about what you want to do. And B should be measurable. This your goal you've picked to check this year. Is it measurable? Can you measure it? At what point will you say you've achieved it? What are the milestones are you looking out to get from this your clear definition of purpose? The other thing you should be looking at should be achievable. Is this goal achievable? Not just talking big. Talking big is, is cheap. I know some of us want to talk at faith. It's good and it's cool. I'm a Christian. I like that. But guess what? You just can't do this. Be specific on what you want to do. Is it achievable? Is it realistic? Imagination is a different ball game from actualization. The fact you can imagine it, you can achieve it. But is it achievable at what realistic angle? Are you looking at it from the next thing you'll be looking at is it time bound at what time do you intend to get this thing done is it the end of january is it the first week of march is it by june ending is it by december is it by october you need to put a timeline to it the next thing we're looking at should not be after the number one which is clear definition of purpose we should look at there are some laws as a geomancer business code we are being taught by John Maxwell, that there are invaluable laws of growth we all need, which is number one, intentionality. You need to be intentional in 2021. There is no room for haphazard movement. You need to be intentional. What is that thing? Just do you intentionally clicked on this video to watch? How intentional are you in your business? How intentional are you in your career? When was the last time? What are your goals? to achieve in your career you need to be intentional about this area because the law of intentionality states that growth don't just happen so if growth don't just happen what should we do to grow we need to be intentional the other we're looking at will be the law of awareness this law simply states that you need to be aware of who you are what you can do for whom you can do it for before you can think of growing it's a new year you need to sit down Ask yourself deep question research into your inner man who am i what can i do how should i do it when should i do it and where should i do it these are my bugging questions i believe you should be driving not just a new resolution of i will not do this if i do this no you need to be specific you need to be aware of who you are and also the last law in this number two should be the law of consistency which says that consistency brings clarity as a business owner i have been able to build a system with my wonderful creative team for the past six years which we are into smart planet facility management smart planet consulting smart planet farms what have kept us going is clarity and consistency if you want to do well in this year you need to be consistent in what you are doing you can't be selling shoe in January and be selling bet in February. You can't be selling bet in February and be selling how building material in March. You can't be selling shoes, you can't be selling plates in June and in December you are selling rice. 
you need to be specific you need to be consistent in that one thing you should be known for in this year so go down and sit back and write that down. and then also you will be looking at what should be your marketing and sales strategy in this new year write it down number three year is marketing and sales strategy what is that thing are you good at what do you want to sell what is that product or services you want to say how do you intend to sell this thing you need to be specific do you want to run social media ad do you want to pay for a class to learn how to use facebook to work be specific go for a training run social media ad i do it a lot i pay for advertisement a lot pay for these things how do you want is it traditional marketing do you want to use in your church in your mosque wherever you worship you can tell people what you do these are your marketing skills do you want to speak in a world of one-to-one -one in your in public transport in your place of work just write it down and also your sales strategy what do you want to make how much do you want to make this year you need to be specific in it write it down let's say this year you let's say this year you want to make 1.2 million era every month you need to make 100,000 era in a month we have four weeks every week how much do you want to make you need to write it down in a week we have seven days how much do you want to make in each day of that 24 hours of a day you need to write it down when do you wake up is your working time starting from when eight o'clock to five o'clock in your business or in your career you need to break these things down this is how you set your sales target don't just say i know i will hammer in this year don't just say i want to make 10 million in my business this year without breaking it down how you tend to break this thing you're going to be looking at should not be your finance and expense strategy what are your plans for your finance this year i know you need money you want to blow the question would be why do you want to blow what are you doing that will generate income for you you need to ask yourself this brings us to your revenue stream you should be able to itemize and break down what are the revenue streams do you intend to engage in in this year not the money doubling scheme or posing everywhere you need to be defined what do i need to do that can bring income remember money is a reward for the solution you offer this is what i teach people in my class every time you don't just wish to get money you need to create a solution a channel an avenue to attract the reward called money money is just on the fulfillment of sources money is not a source because there are many rich people that are sick that money cannot help so don't make money your goal rather in this year make solution your goal why money will become a reward for the solution you are offering now let's go to your expense how do you tend to track your expense this year your core card how do you tend to track it do you just buy data to do what in your phone why are you putting data on your phone is it to watch news or do what or is it for you to reach your market audience define your core message this year track your expenses how much do you spend for your airtime in your business how much do you spend for for advertisement how much for your raw material how much for your overhead cost your staff salary so you put employ people they don't need you don't need overstaffing your business sack some people relieve them of their job and let them go in order for you to keep your balance sheet insane it's a new year you can't continue running down in circles and also be looking at your operational structure in your life you need an sop what do you mean of an sop standard of operation you need this thing in your life in your business you need an, an sop so you should be able to define what do you want to do an sop is simply standard of operations that will make your business work on your behalf if you are not there so you need on your own to define your standard of operation what are those things do you need to put on ground to enable your business work without you being around these are the routine things we need to understand when do you want to pray in your personal life what do you want to achieve when do you want to wake up to read at night what book do you want to conclude this month what are the objectives you want to achieve put it down as your sop in your business this is what you need to do and finally as a roundup should not be I introduce to you the Pareto principles, which simply say that 20% of what we do account for 80% of the result we get. In this new year, focus on the 20% of what will give you results. In your business, focus on the 20% of clients that understand your value proposition, that know what you are offering and go after them. You can't be for everybody, you can't serve to anybody. 
in your career what you need to do define that 20 percent path of productivity that gives you the result to the 80 percent you really truly desire what is that book do you want to read in your family who is that person you need to settle with in your business in your career who is that mentor who is that coach do you want to meet mingle with this year so in this principle it says that i repeat 20 percent of 80 percent of the results you are going to get in this year will come from 20 percent of the things you do right you do accurately you do consistently so thank you have a fruitful year follow us on our website www.smartplanetc.com www.smartplanetc.com it will be showing you your screen follow on our social media platform on our youtube channel where we have a lot of free youtube training for you and finally go to our website we're having a free business consultation on smart planet consulting to help you guide you tailor you on what you need to achieve even the business plan will be done for you for free just book your appointment and guess what we'll work with you show you what we're going to do and have a fruitful new year remember be consistent have clear definition of purpose know your marketing strategy define your intentionality be consistent and create an awareness for yourself bye thank you for staying with us